Hello my dear students, you are welcome to this tutorial. We want to continue the solution of the 2070 North Deck WASI, the private exams for WASI, so that you'll be able to write this year's WASI and pass easily. So I'll take my time to explain. Question 2A. In the diagram, QR is equal to 2 centimeters. Angle PQR is 90 degrees. Angle RSP is 30 degrees. And angle QPR is 45 degrees. Find I, the length of PR. I, I. The length of RS in standard in set form or radicals. So we are asked to find the PR. This is PR. And we were given two centimeters and forty-five degrees. And we're also given that this angle is ninety from the question. So we use a trigonometric ratio that will involve QR, which is opposite to the 45 degrees angle, and will also involve the side we want to find, which is PR. So, opposite and the hypotenuse that will be the sine ratio. So, so means opposite over hypotenuse therefore we take the sign of angle 45 and it should be equal to opposite side which is two centimeters over Q R over P R over P R the side we want to find. So let's simplify this. Sine forty five is equal to one over root two. I'm preferring to use one over root two in this case. Then is equal to 2 over PR. So the next thing we do now, so this is PR. The next thing we do now is to reciprocate both sides. So that will be root 2 over 1 is equal to PR over 2. It's not a mass that you have to reciprocate both sides. We are doing this because both sides are simple for us. They are in their simplest form and they are fractions. We can also decide to cross multiply. Eh? Cross multiply this one. Yeah, so now let's multiply both sides by 2. To get 2 root 2, 2 root 2 is equal to PR. Therefore, PR is equal to 2 root 2 centimeters. Now let's come to the II part. The II part is asking us to calculate. RS RS so we need to use the side of the triangle that will involve QS and 30 degrees then also we need to use the height of the triangle because it's a right angle triangle so the height is the same for both triangle PQR and triangle PQS you should 
be smart enough to know that this angle is also 45 because in a right angle triangle all the angles must give you 90 so if this is 45 this is also 45 that means that triangle PQR is an isosceles triangle therefore this side must also be 2 centimeters So now let's proceed with the II. With the II, we use a trig ratio that will involve 30 degrees, the opposite side, which is 2 centimeters, and the adjacent side, so TOA. TOA is tangent ratio. TOA is the tangent ratio. Therefore, we take tan. 30 than 30 than 30 will be equal to than 30 will be equal to opposite which is 2 centimeters over adjacent which is 2 plus 2 as RS RS that we are finding good so we need to now evaluate the tan 30 which is the same as 1 over root 3 and this is equal to Two all over two plus RS. Now let's proceed over here. The next thing I'm going to do now is to reciprocate both sides. So I'm going, I'm going to get on the left hand side root 3 over 1. I reciprocate both sides. You can cross multiply. Even though it will be a bit longer, you get the same answer. So this will be equal to the reciprocal of this will be 2, 2 plus RS. all over 2 now we can now cross multiply so the reason why I was dodging was the reason why I was doing using this approach or I reciprocated is to dodge the the rationalization uh -huh. but you can also do it that way you get the same answer so when we, put, we multiply both sides by 2, we get 2 times root 3 over, over 1. 2 times root 3 over 1 is the same as root 3. So we get root 3. 2 root 3. Then this will be equal to 2 plus Rs. So the next thing we do is to subtract 2 from both sides. So you get 2 root 3, 2 root 3, minus 2. is equal to Rs. Therefore, Rs is 2 root 3 centimeters. 2 root 3 centimeters. This is the B part of the question. We want to find X. So 
so we can find x by first of all finding this angle here so angle f you know angle f angle f from triangle q f k q f k will be equal to will be equal to 85 okay angle f plus this angle will be equal to this angle so 85 degrees 85 plus angle f will be equal to 130 the reason is that 130 is the remote exterior angle to 85 degrees and angle f this implies that angle f angle f will be equal to 130 minus 85 And that will be equal to 45 degrees. Then also, we need to find X. That is what we are actually looking for. But you could also realize that this 45 degrees angle here, this 45 degrees angle here, is the remote interior angle the remote exterior angle of angle x use vertically opposite angles to get x here so when you add x and 40 you must get 45 from the remote exterior angle property x plus 40 is equal to 45 So we subtract 40 from both sides to get x to be equal to 45 minus 40. And that will be equal to 5 degrees. You can also find this angle. You can also find this angle using 40 degrees 85. The sum should give you 180 together with this. Then after finding this one, you use the remote exterior angle property again. This angle should be equal to x plus 50. You know that when you subtract 130 from 180 you should get 50 so 50 plus x should be equal to this angle over here so any way you do it you get the same result another method is also use the fact that 40 degrees plus 85 degrees will be equal to this angle then move this angle inside or uh, find the supplement which is 50 then 50 plus this angle plus this should give you 180 in fact there are so many ways you can find the value of x so don't forget to like this video then comment then share with your friends then don't forget to subscribe now if you can still see this red thing here it means you have not yet subscribed so you just have to click it so that the next upload you see it is still red you have to click it so that if i upload the next video you'll be informed click the bell icon too so that you get a notification whenever I upload a new video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.